Um, it's really about the Frank O'Geary buildings in Dusseldorf and Toronto. Um, and I wrote it when um, we were still in Germany. Um, but my husband, Vijoy, was already in Canada. Um, I was in Germany. We knew that we were going to be moving. And I, I don't know uh, what it's like for other people, but I, I felt like I needed to have something to anchor onto in this new city that I was going to move move to, this new country, which I knew nothing about. Um, and so I was kind of, I, you know, I, I, it was all completely unfamiliar. Um, and then I discovered that Frank Gehry had just redesigned the Art Gallery of Ontario, the AGO. And I love Frank Gehry's buildings and, you know, the the Neue Zollhof buildings in, in uh, Dusseldorf are, it, probably my my favorite buildings um uh in the city um and so i thought okay i already i have something there i've got something that i can already love and which i can hold on to in a way um and so that was kind of the inspiration uh for for this poem and because oh yes and it's called goldberg variations because um frank gary is actually Frank Gehry was actually born as Frank Goldberg, and he changed his name, I think, fairly early on during his career. So, of course, there's music in it. So here we go. Goldberg Variations. On a clear day, you can sift titanium if you step back far enough. You can watch the sky flex and flow and petrify, constructing chaos out of melody, glass by wood by splinter. The base is the key. Plaster, for example, can make perfect scales when curved with brick or steel to cross an ocean and then break in form like some primeval fish that feeds off the Douglas firs and stirs and comes to rest. Okay. 